Hello everyone, welcome back to that cyber guy. So last week we discussed Nmap, which is a vulnerability scanner. So today we are going to discuss the user interface Zenmap. So Zenmap is a graphical front end for Nmap. It's a powerful and popular network scanning tool. It provides a better user friendly for you to manage and visualize network scans. So it makes it easier for you to use M and the Nmap features. So now, are you ready to just take your vulnerability scannings to the next level? Buckle up and let's get started. Blue type of security and no time. All right, so welcome back. So according to the uh, Nmap or Zenmap documentation, the common Zenmap is deprecated. So it is recommended to use the uh, Zenmap legacy or Zenmap KBX instead. So this is what we are going to use today. So we are going to type, open your terminal first. You know how to do that, guys. And type sudo apt that get update and sudo apt that get install and then zenmap dash kpx and hit enter i need my password So I'll pause the video and be back once the installation is complete. All right, our installation is complete. As you can see, it takes longer than expected because we upgraded the system and then install Zenmap. So if you want, you can just only install Zenmap, you know, from the beginning, but you know, it is always a good idea to upgrade and update your system. So now we can go up to our search bar and type Zenmap. As you can see here, you can double click while this is open. So what I can do, I can just go there to the search bar again and type Nmap and double click on it. So I'm trying to op open both Nmap and Zenmap to show you how you can just you know use Zenmap you know with nmap because you know both of them they are similar zenmap comes with a user interface where you can just actually utilize all the command without just memorizing them now we have two command let's see here yeah what we can do as you can see uh, the tools is very self-explanatory for Zenmap. You can uh, just go ahead and just do everything that you can. You can like you know from Nmap to Zenmap without just typing any command. So you can have a, uh, a this is a command for a basic scan. If you wanna do an intent scan, you can actually do that. If you wanna just do uh, scan all TCP. You see, you know, once you choose an option, it automatically tell you what version that you can use, what, what kind of comment that you can use on Nmap with that. So last week we just used, you know, the Nmap only, but you know, this week we have uh, Zenmap. So if you wanna do like a uh, basic scan, so let me see here. And then, uh, we can do a quick scan which is a basic and then I can put the IP address uh, of any uh, target machine in my case this is the Medax variable and I can hit scan and that same command that you know I have here I can actually just if I want to use the nmap use interface I can actually you know paste that comment right here let me try to paste it Say again here. 
hit enter. Oh, there was a typo at the end. Hit enter, you see, this is the same thing from the uh, user interface or the command line when you use Nmap. And then uh, the benefit of Nmap uh, is that you can just have more interesting, you can just see the network topology. You can actually uh, click and uh, uh, just, you know, see, you know, the topology of the network, which is very cool. And you can see the host details like IP address, open port, etc and much more in the services etc so this was just a, a quick video to show you guys how if you're afraid of the uh command line if it if the command line uh feels like intimidating to you you can actually use zenmap to uh scan system instead of nmap now uh if you want to learn more or just have any questions feel free to put them to the comment section and if you want to learn more you can check out our videos we have so many videos for you to just put your cyber security skills to the next level make sure that you like subscribe and share so you do not miss out with the latest cyber security trends thank you